But this, of course, Ant, brings us to the foolishness of the week. And in a week, I feel like that guy who does the, 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 movie, the movie voiceovers, right? In a world defined <laughs> by... <laughs> Do you even have the first idea what the foolishness of the week is? Can you? No, my, even... whole, my whole world is foolishness at this point. <laughs> that, that, that's right. How could you sift through it all? Um, <laughs> but every week, somehow or another, one person or group of people rises to the top as cream in a bottle, right? And, and this week, we have the good people at Fox News who put out an infographic on television that showed how much the stock market rose after various black men were killed by police. Oh my. What, what, what in they God's thinking? green earth are you thinking? That in what world is that appropriate, smart? I, I don't even know what to say about this. And they backpedaled on it pretty quickly, you know, after the backlash. Um, but this this is profoundly distasteful at best. There are far worse things we might say about it. We won't hear, and we'll let people draw their own conclusions. But we have a copy of the infographic, which was, of course, pulled by Fox News sometime immediately after they put it up. Um, but we've got a copy of it in a news story, and if you click the links in the show notes, you can see it for yourself. But this is easily the most tasteless thing I have seen in a week jam-packed with tasteless things. But I don't even know what kind of point you'd be trying to make with an infographic like that. Well, I, I think the point is that it's not so bad when the police kill an unarmed black man. See? Well, that's, your, 401, wow. your 401k does better. Right? That fails, it, on, that fails on so many levels. It, it's exactly as horrible as you might think at first glance. It, it's just pathetic. And... Who the hell fell asleep at the switch over at Fox that this even got on the air? How many people had to see it from the unintelligent person who made it all the way to the producer who greenlighted it? Who greenlit it? Yeah. You, you can look at this thing and just think, who could have looked at that and given it a thumbs up? And yet there it was. And you can't take things like that back. 